Hello everyone, I am Roselle Dilar. In the previous video we have built a turtle rack name of park in the horizontal stack here and the vertical stack here. Now we are going to build the circle image here. Okay, let's go and build that. We put two texts to the horizontal stack and we put turtle rack to the vertical stack and we are ready. Instead of adding more code in this file, we will create a custom view that applies a mask, border and drop shadow to the image. I have previously added the image to the assets. It's here now. You can get this image in the description below. You can get it from my GitHub account or you can get it in developer.apple.com. Okay, let's go and create an Swift UI. I'm going to say new file. Now I'm going to select Swift UI in user interface. Circle image. And I'm gonna say create. Okay, here's another view with a body property and the preview property. It is it is just as same in the content view, but this one is another view, and I'm gonna embed this view into content view. Let's go and do that. I'm gonna get rid of from this. I'm gonna say this is an image. The image called turtle rock. Okay, my image is here now. I am going to call the clip shape clip shape. Shape would be circle. I call it the clip shape method to apply the circular clipping shape to the image. The circle type is a shape that you can use as a mask or as a view by giving the circle a stroke or fill. Okay, here we are ready. I'm going to format this code. I am pressing the Ctrl I button. Now uh, let's go and add a stroke here. My stroke would be white. And I'm going to say overlay. By the way, let's get rid of from these things. Yeah, this is better. I'm gonna add stroke in the shape of circle as an overlay. Color would be white. And the line width. But before, I think white shape is in the back, but we can't see it. Let's put it to gray and we can see it. I created another circle with a gray stroke and then I added as an overlay to give the image a border. Okay, let's go and add a shadow with 10 point radius. Radius is gonna be 10. Let's format this code again. Okay, I think our image is ready. In the next video, we will add a map wheel as here and then we will combine all of them together. Thank you for watching. See you soon guys. Bye bye.